What is going on YouTube and welcome back to another edition of Clear Cryptos Education on the Clear Cryptos Education channel. My name is T Hobbs from the Crypto Shop. That man above is Jay Seals. What's going on, brother? What's up? How's it going? Not much, man. Today on the Clear Cryptos channel, we're going to be discussing a pretty important subject. Uh, for those of you in the DeFi space, you probably know about Dex tools. Dex tools is pretty much the number one tool that people use in DeFi to purchase their pairs here. Um, there's multiple pairs here, probably over 17,000. But in this video, we're going to try to teach you how to navigate Dex tools. A lot of this stuff you may know how to do, some of it you may not know, but we're going to try to break down each and every sector of Dex tools, starting with the Dex tools dashboard. So this is the uh, Dex board or the Dex tools dashboard. It works very, very similar to a coin market cap or anything like that. Basically, you can go here very, very top. You'll have all of your ads. Click on those at your leisure. Um, but the important stuff is your biggest gainers on a day is going to be in this section right here. This is where a lot of people go to, you know, try to find the biggest gainers on the day. Uh, sometimes you can make money in those in those areas. I wouldn't recommend it because I don't recommend buying at high big gainers and, and green candles but if you want to kind of know what's running hot that day you can look here in the biggest gainers section right here same thing here for biggest losers uh, a lot of the ones that come over here are uh actual tokens that are probably migrating to v2s they're most likely going to lead lead the way i know uh bnb on the ape side never heard of it atm never heard of it but i have heard of phantom and uh recently they're actually doing a migration to a v2 contract so that's why they're here in the biggest losers what that do what they do in that situation they drain the liquidity completely out so it's going to make their chart look extremely negative and then uh recently updated socials category it lets you know uh when we get into the actual charting i'll show you exactly where to find these socials but when somebody has recently updated those socials you'll be able to find the ticker symbol here of the top three or the most recent and then uh, it'll show you exactly what the uh, ticker symbol or what social media they actually had uploaded it now down here you'll see the pairs and you can pretty much um you can break this down or categorize this categorize this however you want it some people may do it by price you know some people may do it by 24 hour price variation you can do it by volume there's multiple ways you can separate this very very similar to uh dex tools and if you want to just go ahead and look at it you can either one you can click on the show live data which will take you directly to the chart or you can click on uh find other pairs which means you can see uh what other uh tokens that this particular uh token is paired with whether it be with eth whether it be with bnb avalanche whatever the token pair is you'll see all of that by clicking on the um binoculars here um the next part that i wanted to go through and uh we'll go ahead and hit the um the live new pair section and i'll let justin kind of break that down for you as well all right so the the live new pairs is going to be all the pairs that are brand new that are live uh and they they update regularly it'll even have a countdown for you that'll tell you when it's actually going to either be launched live or how long it's been live for so as you can see the first one has been listed uh since the last 11 minutes now and counting and so yeah if you if you ever want to get a jump on a uh a live pairing you would go to this tab to do it especially if you know that uh there's a launch about to happen. This is the quickest way to find uh, the pair that you're looking for that's just being launched. Exactly. And then uh, other actions you'll see over here to the right is uh, whether the contract, where the contract is loaded up at, uh, what swap you can find it on, all that type of information. And again, always you can see this bar, this data bar, and it'll always take you to show live data. So kind of moving on we get that actual uh, technical analysis live data pair right here, pair explorer, where it'll take you into, it always kind of drops you right into Dex tools, which is like the, the token of the actual chart that we're reading. So in this particular category, there's lots and lots of information to soak in. So I can kind of break it down to you as quickly as possible. So one thing you'll notice is up here, you got your hot pairs. All this means is these are the pairs that are, that are streaming live on Dex tools right now that may be um, moving up in category. It has one through 10. Basically, you see the top 10 
and then 11 through 14 is just kind of blanked out but the top 10 hottest tokens that are receiving the most value uh, are going to usually be up here in the top 10 live pairs now you do one thing to remember though that people can actually pay tokens can actually pay to be listed in hot pairs so there's an actual fee that you pay dex tools that they will actually list you up here because there's people that literally come here and just watch hot, hot pairs and try to make a quick flip on their investment so just be wary of that when you're looking at hot pairs and you're using hot pairs uh, up here you have your search pair by symbol name contract or token so if i wanted to search a pair let's say uh uniswap right i would type in uniswap at the top and then i would see all of the uh pairings for uniswap down here we have wrapped ethereum we have bnb so on and so forth right you just scroll up and you'll see all of the different pairings for uh uniswap or whatever token it is you're trying to uh look into in that situation over here in the top right you have your layout what that does is it just changes everything as you see it basically based off your preference so you can put your favorites currently have favorites listed on the right you can move them over to the left columns on the left and full screen chart all right um the settings tab not much you can really do there i use it basically to switch from dark mode that's probably the biggest thing you can switch from light which is scary to me to uh dark mode um it's better on the eyes so I, I really like looking at every all of my charts in dark mode uh heart pairs movement you can turn it you can turn that movement off so it just stays freezes for you and then you can enable the dex chart or you can disable the dex chart as well so uh i don't have my browsing notifications on and you know, unless you use Dex schools exclusively, I don't really suggest you throw that on there as well. Um, connect the wallet. Now, Dex tool is a swap, so you can connect your wallet to Dex tools. I believe you have to be logged in as a member, sign up, and then you can actually trade directly on Dex tools, or you can just kind of use it to switch over to Uniswap. So, moving on, you have the title of the token that you that you're using or you're viewing right here again you have those binoculars from earlier that we went over uh where you can find other pairs and then you have all of the information that you need here the coin market cap the ether scan coin gecko bubble maps uh and metamask so basically you can find everything you need or everywhere you can find this token you'll find it in this category here but then you can also find the website information the email information telegram twitter and uh discord information in my time in crypto if a particular token doesn't have these things kind of filled out that's kind of a red flag right you want to be able to view you know you, you give them time but at the same time you want to be able to get have all of this stuff kind of verified through dex tools and be able to get to all of their socials on this tab here um moving on you have your pool information this is where you can find the stats on the token right so you can find the total liquidity, the volume, the pooled ETH, DEX, market cap, holder count, total transactions. You can unfold and see the circulating supply, the total supply, the date it was created, and the percentage pooled by DEX, and then um, how much one ETH is uh, per DEX. So in this situation, it's 9,084 9 uh, DEX will get you one ETH worth of, uh, or one ETH will get you that much of uh, DEX. And then if you ever wanted to swap, again, you have that same option as you had here above, connect your wallet, or gives you this option right away. You can go click here, and it'll take you right over to Uniswap. Um, I do recommend you double checking the Uniswap uh, address just to make sure it's the correct address. But usually Dex Tools is pretty, pretty reliable when it comes to that type of stuff. Uh, and then last but not least, you have your Dex Tools chart. Here it is uh, basically a reflection of the trading view chart. It works very, very similar. So uh, up here above, you have your time frames, five minute to a day. You have your candle preference. Uh, we're currently looking at Hakanashi candles. You have your ind indicators tabs where you can basically throw as many indicators as you want on here. You have the name of the token. You have the max uh, buy and the minimum buy. And then you can choose to expand uh, the chart as well. Um, you can take pictures of the chart and you can change your settings as you see fit. 
and yeah so basically all the rest of this kind of works exactly like trading view um you can go back and look at another one of our uh, videos to show you exactly you know how trading view works or at least looking at some of the key elements of trading view i hope you gathered a lot of information and this was helpful in your journey in trading on the first part but don't forget to tune in to the second part of this video on dex tools trading but my name is t hobbs from the crypto shop that guy above is jay seals and we'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.